I'm certain that we have to cross that fence, but I just can't find the way. Can you help me? Sure, Joke. In a jiffy. Just gotta finish something first. You're staring at that skull. It's my grandpa. I'm asking him if he knows where my Danny is. You don't need to ask that skull. No. You weren't there when it happened. So your grandpa is... Not right now. He's... I sure hope he finds someone who can... Dude, they moved the skeletons here in the 18th century. Then he's my super mega great. Are you getting used to that? One? Sure. Now I'm afraid it'll go up. I don't remember giving you a lighter. How typical. You found I'm keeping it like a. Can you lend me the lighter? No, no. That headlight will. How do you know that? You're so close to the. Come on, Joe. Oops. You're sure of the light? Yes, I'm sure. Okay. Are you sure, Pauline? Again, no. I saw her this morning. Thanks for arranging things. As soon as you said catapult, not just my mind. But now I'm... What's the matter? Problems? Yeah, maybe. What I'm looking for may be beyond the fence. Do you know how to open it? Nope. I tried once, but... I know you don't talk a lot to Pauline? To me? Moreover, the group gave me the cold... Thanks for the headlight. I didn't tell Boris. But then I bought them because... 
You said that the catacombs police were- One hour. That is in case they have- Why did you join the- Money. I know. But the rest of the gang found it. Boris told me they kicked you out of the catacombs. Yeah. Some things now. What did change was the no- are you sure you haven't seen the medallions? Not at all, but this is the- Okay, the catacombs will be patrolling- Boris told me that you- Always answering the- So the skeletons weren't- he Stupid, but well, they brought them here between 17 and- Parisians love to die- what do the Nazis have to do with these stupid quests? But anyway, those bastards built a subterranean. The cool thing is, they didn't... They celebrated black masses here? Stupid question number three. Congratulations. But yeah, there are some remains in some of them. You didn't find a white... No. Which joke do you... Hey, look, it's my grandpa. Always the same lunatic with the same nonsense. The worst thing... Are you sure it was the right leg that was cut off? Hmm. Is it that important? Are you sure it was the right leg that was cut off? Hmm.
these pivots on. Are you getting you? Sure. Now I'm. A I don't remember how I'm keeping it. Staring. It's my. Are you sure? Again, I saw. Thanks for. I soup, not but. Are you getting me? sure? Now I'm afraid. Can you let? Okay.
My guess is that if you pass a rope through the rings on the well, then we'd have sort of a handrail for me to grab onto. Okay, let's hurry. Well, it seems you're on the right path. Let's go. There you go. Hey, don't die, okay? Dear Deacon Yago, if you are reading this, my suspicions were right. You transmuted, and if you've managed to get here, then the order of Yago is not as safe as it needs to be. Now it's your turn to protect the treaty of the flesh. I think of you as a demon redeemed for the divine cause, like a new St. Paul, and I congratulate myself on having caused that redemption. You not only saved me, but also gave a new meaning to my existence. I pray that I'm now giving a new meaning to yours. May God be with you, my friend Yago. Fergus Quinlan, Rome, October the 27th, 1558.
Come on, the catacombs are about to come. Let's move, Boris. That's what you were looking for? Yes. Hi, dear. Amanda? You? I lost track of you in New York, but thanks to your friend Cell, I was able to track you down. Now, you'll let us tie you up, you'll get on the boat, and if you try anything, he dies. Is that okay?
good Vulcan. No. You. You can't be. You died at St. Fergus 500. The Inquisition killed you and burned down the church with your body in it. I'm afraid you're mistaken. A coin was enough after making you drink and stabbing you when they set the church on fire. I thought I quickly poured mercury in them. I didn't dare leave the church until two. I looked for you among the birds. How could I be sure? It worked. But you know the best part? 500 years later, you used me and turned... You condemned me to a... Why did you come back, Hina? Torture? With that? Not at all. I'm back because I hate myself. I beg you to... I want you to kill me. I want to die once and for all. For good and only you can help me, my son. Ursus! I told you nothing would happen. Please, follow me outside. Take the wine set and blow out the candles. Our host will arrive at dusk. In the meantime, will you think about my request? Please. Where's the other guy? Poor Ronald. Goodbye, my dear gardener. You had wonderful green fingers. He cried blood when he started reading it. Just like you said he would. Hi, honey. Mr. Yesterday. Amanda, go find the madman. He has to be here somewhere. Lenny, you bring up Ginesa's alchemy table. And get this shit out of here. Well, well, well. Why the long face? So I suppose you're hunting down immortals all over the world? Now that you mention it, I feel honored. 100% of the world's... But don't get me wrong. Your old friend is here of his... Up what did you do to Boris? What did we do? Lenny just told me he did Don't try to fool me. Pines, is there anything you didn't tell Does he have any powers? I hope not. Little Vic? Don't act surprised, Mr. Yesterday. I've known Father Ginez for a long time. Oh, I can't stand children crap. Let's just say that So, are you going- Satan, you won't leave until I- They told me my- I entered the first nursing home. I, I guess it never occurred to me that there could- I ran away from home because I haven't- Ah, well. My granddad is sick. There's a little- Oh. A lady at the door told- We'll wait. Sir? I haven't had a name for a long time. I don't have a lot of friends. There's my nanny, Dorothy. There's something I don't understand. If your granddad, you must be real. I mean, my nan was 87. Oh. I, I don't think I'm... Listen here, little girl. Of course, Miss... I was your grandmother's age, the first, but years before, they told me it gave you the power to come back to life at the same... But what if that... And didn't you have any friends? I had. Two good friends. Ursus. Ursus died in a fire. As for Vulcan, uh, I lost. I spent decades searching for him. You could have looked up that. <laughs> Although, no. Doctors know about the. I couldn't ask him. I searched for every few, and I can't. You're not a. They just opened up my throat. I'll say. Shh. Shit. See? It's easy. Shit! Nice. 
don't let anyone shit shit shit. <laughs> I could. He could. Uh, although. You know a lot. Well, my granddad. I don't know, Rick, but. You're a good man, Mr. Now it's my turn. Yes. Could you. What's going to happen to you? No one should die. Stay with me. And don't stop. <laughs> He died right there in front of me. And I stood there for nearly half an hour. And he did. It was true! Hello. You're so lucky! I'm not so sure. I'll die again in a few weeks. But I might not be as lucky as I was to. They'll cert it. I'll die. Then they'll him and I'll die. But I won't f Luckily that didn't happen. It took me 40 years. But I found you at last. And together we found your beloved Vulcan. The treaty, and also, surprise, we even found a judgment coin. The time has come. I ask you, please, read the treat, please. So I shall, for Alonzo, for Fergus, for me, for all the lives you dis- Not even you deserve this. Thank you. Listen, don't waste any more of my t None of that shit is going- We're going to mix up a new transmute. But I'm the one who's going- I'm not gonna do that. You will, because if you don't, I'll kill you. It might take- Miss Baxter, the madman is nowhere to be found. But I did find this. Pauline! Oh! Forget the madman. Here's an even better offer. Wouldn't you just love an immortal girlfriend? I'll come back, John. It takes Rinas a while to come back. What about her? I'm... I'm alive! And you don't know how happy that makes me. Amanda, keep an eye on them. I promise that when we find another coin, you'll be... Shit.